thought I was in the pokies then. <laughs> what, you thought you had a win for a change? <laughs> oh, I love the smell of leather. Oh, it's nice, isn't Whips it? and chains. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot to tell you something, Dave. Something very important. Maybe disturbing, not for us. Snoring. And when she starts snoring, will I wake her? No fucking way. Just let her sleep. Well, he grabs out a fucking big iPad out of his fucking case, didn't he? Yeah. I found myself doing that corner at 1.20 and then sort of slipped out a bit because of that. Oh, what a fucking <laughs> shit that is. <laughs> and then you've got this. Look at this. You got things under control? You're 18 size niggas, babe. <laughs> I'm washing them for you. Oh, you're a good hey? man. I'm it's all about the sunset. It's yes. about romance. Isn't it, eh? It's about romance, babe. See, I put Romance my... in the box. Let's get out, we can leave this city. Let's drive to the open air. Yeah, the countryside is so pretty. With the wind blowing in your hair. We can look back someday. Baby, don't you understand? That we only get one life away. This is a motel for the night. Right here on the back of the main street. And this here is your main street of Ondorf. In a boat. Ondorf. Right here. Hmm. Okay, which way, babe? Um, which way are we going to go? Go up the street first. Okay, let's go. We've got to work out where we can get grog from and where we're going to get tea from. Do you want to grog's, grog's not really going to be a problem in this town, but. Getting grog that we like might be the problem. Might not. Very pretty, isn't it? Oh, red hot specials. Pretty little hand off, isn't it? What's this? German cuckoo clocks. Do you want to have a look at cuckoo clocks? <laughs> look at all the cuckoo, cuckoo clocks. If you think Kim sends me cuckoo, look at that. That's hey. only balmy. <laughs> hey. I thought I was in the pokies then. <laughs> what, you thought you had a win for a change? <laughs> All the detail on them. Okay, a leather shop. Oh, I love the smell of leather. Oh, it's nice, isn't Whips it? Whips and chains. Do you want one of them for around your hat, babe? Yeah. A crocodile undo thing? Yeah. Oh, look at all the money. Mm. In different parts of the world. Man, look at that. Cool. Uh. I think put your bullets in here, though. The crocodile. Yeah, your croc skin there. Or is that alligator? It's got an American flag there. I reckon it's alligator, oh, that yeah. one. Cute. Tons of stuff in here, isn't there? I, I wish I'd smell a GoPro. <laughs> because it smells fantastic. Look. That was the leather shop here Look. at Handoff. That's Kim's friends, Em. Mm -hmm. Don't hop on the sheep's back. No. Why? <laughs> Look, there's an upsy down clown. Hop on him. Yeah, you'd hop on that one, wouldn't you? <laughs> <laughs> That's the leather smith and bush gallery. Oh, look at this little sheepy baby. Oh, how cute. Hey. Hello. Hello. This is all downtown Handoff, isn't it, babe? Yep. Some sort of cafe. Pantry. Mmm. Very good. Very pretty little town. It is. It's such a long street. It is. Lighting, handbags, and clocks. Clocks. Yeah. That's pretty. Old Mill Hotel, Steakhouse. Ah, oh, well, now we're talking. <laughs> now we're talking, talking mate. That's a delivery car. We're going to get steakhouse. run over. See? That's cute. <laughs> Listen to it. She's <laughs> <laughs> a great little town, Handoff. Yeah. We are wandering around a bit quick because everything will start to close on us otherwise. Then we'd have to stay an extra day. What a oh, shame. What a shame. <laughs> <laughs> uh. 
That's a nice big old pub. What's it called, babe? The German Arms Hotel. Yes. They seem to sell a lot of Han beer here in this Harndorf. Harndorf selling Han beer? Jeez, babe. It's a bit strange, isn't it? It is. Uh, they've got a recipe. Ooh, let's have a look at it. Jeez. Let's have a look at the menu. Popcorn chicken. German selection. Comfort food. <laughs> We've already had enough comfort. And they've got flower box in the window sill. Keep it down the road, babe. Is it? Yes. Promoting your um, T-shirt there, Rusty. What, babe? Promoting your T-shirt. Cool. What is it? Kimmy Russ Adventures at YouTube.com. This looks nice. It's Look the this. same one as we just looked oh, at. Is it? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We're back. Sorry, look, no, I didn't mean it, but we're back. I forgot. No, I forgot to tell you something, Dave. Something very important. Maybe disturbing, not for us, but I don't know. You see, we're walking up the street of Handoff today. Waddling along, weren't we? Waddling. You were waddling, I was plodding. <laughs> Wait, it's when you're on holidays, but. We're going up the street, oh, right? Yeah, 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 you don't... What, you can't remember? I do now, you just woke One me famous up. moment and you don't remember? You just woke me up, I had to take a minute. <laughs> yeah, well, we're walking up the main street and three kids, school kids, school kids, the oldest would have been 11, 12, I reckon. No, 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 he said seven. Oh, fuck. Seven. Well, any what? No, no, not the oldest, wasn't. I was great. Yeah, 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 great. Sir. Well, there's three of them. And they come up behind us. Oh, are you YouTube vloggers? Are they? Because we had the GoPro in our hand. And they said, Are you YouTube vloggers? Vloggers? Are you? What's your channel? What's your channel? And I looked at Kim. And Kim looked at me. And I looked at Kim again. And I looked back. Well, I said, Oh, not knowing whether we should give them our YouTube channel. And um. They said, can we be on your channel? Oh, well, no, nah, drew a line there. Drew, definite line there. You're not coming on our channel. I said, no, no. we need your parents' permission. I said, you can't do that. They I understand. said, we're not, fi we're not up film. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, no that's okay. Then we had our t-shirts, just run on. Get my hers on. I said, can I take a picture of your logo on the back? Yeah, look, that one there. Somewhere there. I don't know if you can Stop see. Yeah, well, sorry. Down a bit. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. So, what's it? They said, can we take a picture? Well, he grabs out a fucking big iPad out of his fucking case, didn't he? Yeah. Now, he took a picture so he'd remember our YouTube channel, and I thought, Kim and I said, all right, see kids, bye. bye. We didn't want nothing <laughs> else. I thought, well, well it's not our should we have told him it's ratings and overs, or is it an extra subscriber? Well, extra or, three. Or when the parents even, find out, God help us all. Even the little one in grade two had subscribed. He said, I'll subscribe. <laughs> but they were so excited. They were. I couldn't bear to tell him that, well, there may be content there that's not the best. It wouldn't have mattered. They would have watched it anyway. Yeah. yeah. At least she hasn't got our Facebook at the moment, I guess. Yeah. yeah. I, I seen them down the street later on with their mother. And yeah. duck, we ducked her. <laughs> <laughs> I think they're fucking looking for us. So anyway, it's that time of the night. Look, I'll give Kim a bottle beside her bed. Baby's going to bed. Man, I tell you. Oh, Rusty's lucky. <laughs> 15 minutes and she's fucking... Gone out like a light. Snoring. And when she starts snoring, will I wake her? No fucking way. Just let her sleep. Just let her sleep. Yeah. Right? Once she goes to sleep, do not wake her, okay? Well, you just woke me then. I was dozing. Yeah, she fucking was because she's just had a... Gluttony full of food, haven't you? Oh, I've had a guys, we're going. Oh, yeah. Okay, Kimmy's on the way. She's pushing her dog back. Look at her. Look at her. Uphill, babe. Uphill. 
Oh, fuck. Cushion shit up here, man. You well with his shit, yes. You've got it, babe. You've got it. I need to go to bed. Oh, there you go. Should be just be able to sneak around there, babe. That's it. Yep. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> See ya. You're going the other way. <laughs> You're going the other way. See ya, babe. Bye, babe. Okay guys, this is Handoff again. I don't know how much of it you've seen yesterday. We had some issues talking to Kim coming in here yesterday, didn't we, babe? Technical issues. Technical issues with Henry the GPS interfering too much. Then I turned him off, then I lost communication with Kim. And then Kim started freaking out. Oh, Kim started crying. I turned around and came back here. She's on the side of the road talking. <laughs> nah. It was shocking. Well, we had a nice night here last night. It's such a beautiful town. Wouldn't mind coming back here to explore the area properly. Yeah. I mean, we could do it while we're here, but then we wouldn't have an excuse to come back, would we? That is true, yes. Yes. We got in a bit late yesterday to do anything. Well, we didn't get in late. We got in early, didn't we? We got in about 1.30. The time we had a shower and everything went down the street, we found out everything starts closing about bloody 4 o'clock, 4.30, as in all the German shops and all that stuff, not the pubs. So, uh, in the end, we rushed around, didn't we, babe? Yeah. But look at this. Isn't this beautiful? It is, isn't it, babe? Yeah, it's oh, lovely. There's a walking track down there. We could have went down there. Oh, God. As if we didn't do enough bloody walking up downtown. Well, I didn't think we did, but anyway. Yeah, we're coming down in the, in the outskirts of Hobart. Not Hobart. We were just <laughs> talking about that, weren't we? That, this it looked like it. Yeah, this reminded us of Hobart, didn't we, babe? Yeah. Um, coming down off the eastern shores towards um, the Tasman Bridge now, didn't we, babe? Yeah. Have a look at this taxi in front of us, guys. I've never seen that something more fucking stupid in my life. He's got his COVID check-in apps on those side windows there. Now, man, oh, man, how could he see out them fucking windows? It's an obstruction. <sighs> Tell you. Look at this beautiful countryside, guys. The road's a bit rough, isn't it, babe? It is a little. Yes. We're on the Fluoro Way at the moment, just past Aldinga, wasn't it, babe? Yep. Aldinga. And heading towards Victor Harbour. GPS has got caught in, put in the naughty corner. Yeah. Henry was put in the naughty corner for about 10 minutes because Henry couldn't get us out of Narralunga. <laughs> Uh, we got ourselves out there virtually, didn't we, babe? Yeah. Henry and the bloody Google wouldn't get us out actually first up, would it? No. They both were uh, chucking hissy fits, so I put Henry in the corner for 10 minutes. Turned him back on, now he's picked up a road, so that's a good thing. Little bastard he is. Yeah. Oh, fucking bumpy through here. Thanks. Gave me warning and I missed it. Yeah. Uh, they've got such a great way, the fluoro way, and the fucking road here is shit. It's atrocious. It's marked to be fixed, but yeah. it should, should have been done. I remember a couple of years ago when we come down through this way, it was fairly bumpy though. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, up and down, all this bit. There's, There's a the great water. views here, guys. It is the water, isn't it, babe? Yep. Beautiful and blue today, too, by the looks of it. Really beautiful scenery, I can tell you. Nice road too. Sounds like Kim must be concentrating. She's not uh, talking. It's a few sketchy bits there, back there. The road's a bit uneven in places. Yeah, it's a little bit uneven in places. I found myself doing that corner at 120 and then sort of slipped out a bit because of that. Oh, what a fucking <laughs> shit that is! <laughs> <Uneven>. <laughs> I doubt with that bike's been up the 120 for a long time. Oh, she'll go. Oh, yeah, I know. I've got no doubt she'll go. When she passing the road train. Oh, yeah, yeah. Only because I tell you what's out for tyre blowing out. <laughs> then Kim knows where the throttle is then. Don't you, babe? I do. Yeah. Truly magnificent part of the world, this same. Really is. Oh guys, we're coming into Yankalilla. Yankalilla? We think that's the way we pronounce it, don't we? Yank, Yank something. Yeah, Yankalilla. Yanka, where we go, what is it? 
Yankalilla. Yeah, Yankalilla. That'll do, what I was wondering. Yeah, that'll do. So this is the little town of Yankalilla. Yankalilla. Yeah, it's a tongue twister in a boat. Yeah, they all are. Yeah. Yeah, it's Yankalilla. Yeah, it there just you go. Looks strange. Yeah. Remember coming through here before? I don't know. Some parts I remember clearly, and some parts I don't. Man. Kim gets lost real easy. Now, I was lost a little while ago, so imagine how fucking lost Kim was. <laughs> <laughs> I'm never lost as long as I'm following you. Yeah, yeah, babe. But I'm saying I'm lost. I don't know where I am. There's a leather shop there, babe. Yeah. wonder if they sell vest extenders. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I need some. Why do you need vest extenders for, babe? Because my vest shrunk. How did your vest shrink? Your leather vest we're talking about. Leather vest shrunk because I got it wet. Oh, right, okay. And why did you get it wet? Must have rained. No, I don't think so. Welcome to Normanville by the sea, guys. So this is little Normanville, guys. Normanville, known locally as Normie, is located three kilometres west of Yankalilla. Normanville is a pleasant and popular holiday resort town which is easily accessible from Adelaide. There was a time when it was a busy port servicing the area which was once one of South Australia's richest wheat belt districts. By the sea guys. Where you want to park babe? Oh, I don't know, back down Welcome there. aboard the Freight Train Express, eh, babe? That's it. That's our sweetie. Yep. And we are at Normanville Beachside at the moment, aren't we? Tearing it up in this town. Tearing it up, yeah. yes. This is it here. I'll take you over there and show you in a minute. We've got a couple of other biker friends here, haven't we, babe? Yeah. They're over in the kiosk over on the left there, babe. That's their bikes right there. And a spider. <laughs> What's, what's that like, Kimmy? That's very nice. What is it? Chalk lover's cone. Chalk lover's cone. I'm having a cone. Is that like the lover's arch no. that we see? No, no, that was fake. No, it wasn't fake. Yeah, this is real. No, this no. is a cone. <laughs> She'll be off red if that's a cone, won't she? <laughs> okay, then, guys. So we're down here at Normanville Beach. I suppose Normanville Beach in the boat. Yeah, I didn't see anything different. That's the kiosk and that. Mm -hmm. Did you want to go down to the wharf or what? Where's that? It's just there. Alright. Or do you want to have a look? I'm going to get my boots dirty. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> Are your boots okay? Yeah, they're fine. Are you sure? They're only new, you know. Oh, yeah, well, I suppose they're your Harley ones too. Yeah, they are. Yeah. I don't think you're allowed out on it, babe. No, it's roped off. Oh. A few boats out there. There is. It's beautiful, isn't it? That's Come cool. back up here. Hang on, I heard somebody's put a video out. Of what? Daniel. Oh, wow. Hey, Daniel, have we Daniel's got a smart a TV out. tonight? <laughs> Daniel's put a video out for crying out loud. It's great views in the boat. Beautiful. Hey? Very pretty. Very pretty indeed. And then you get here and it's gorgeous. Oh, it's stunning. Stunning, babe, stunning. <laughs> so we're down in Normville Beach. I've said yes, I know I've repeated myself a few times now. Absolutely stunningly beautiful. Not much of a breeze, nice day, isn't it? Mm. And we're on the way to Victor Harbour, around the Fluro Way. But why wouldn't you stop off here at a beautiful place like this? Look at this. Huh. Watch out, babe, I'm coming around. I'm doing a pan shop, oh, babe. Oh, OK. OK. Normanville Beach will leave. It's a nice little area down here, isn't it? You, it? You'd be you'd be wrapped living in this little town. Oh, it'd be nice. Yeah, nice beach. There's the toilets here, babe. Where? Just here on the oh, right. right. What, do you want to go? Um, oh, yeah. yeah. 
Here she comes. I think she got lost. Look, here she comes. Bouncing down there. When she went across that toilet, she went to the toilet. Now, when she went across there, she stopped there and she looked for ages to see where she had to go. Now, I don't understand what she doesn't understand about a girl dressed in a skirt painted on the side of the toilets is a woman's toilet. No, she didn't realise that. How'd you go, babe? I noticed you got lost on the way over there. Do you look thinner? Do you have a shit, you dirty bitch? Get out of here! Get on your bike! No, don't want your ass on my bike. Get, get, get! Well, yeah, you're going all red there. Did you get lost? Yeah, I know you got lost. Yeah, well, I went, I was walking down and I realised I, I, I was meant to be on that path over there. Yes, I realised. I was just telling the guys. I had to go through the bushes. <laughs> get on your bike. I never made it to the toilet, you know. I was beyond the bushes. Yeah, no, that wouldn't surprise me either. Bloody hell. Oh, did I not tell you guys she got lost? Simple thing like that. Guys, if you want to see something of beauty, you come down around through this way. This is actually absolutely beautiful riding up through here. There's a bit here in a minute with these pines and everything. It's stunning. Brings tears to old Rusty's eyes. <laughs> no, it does, but it does. I'm not fucking joking. Look at that. That's just nice. Look at them hills. And then, over the other side, you've got this, look. You wait till we go up past these pines, guys. It is stunning. The ones up on the right, I mean. Because you're looking out across the water. Look at that, will ya? I love it around this way. This here. This here, I always remember this. Same, mm. I do. Remember this from last time. I've only been up through this way once, but look at that. Tell me I'm fucking lying, guys, if that ain't beautiful. I suppose beauty is in the eye of the beholder, but still. Oh. And then you've got this. Look at this. Just look at it. Oh. Cutting through the mountains. Yeah, cutting through them. That's spectacular, guys. Look at that. Are we not blessed to be able to ride right over here? We really are. Aha! Oh, lover's Arch again, babe. Here we go again. Yeah, look, here's the Lover's Arch, sweetie. And um, what do you call this one? Lover's Arch. Oh, of what? Just Lover's Arch. Oh. <laughs> Why aren't we aren't there any lovers in there? No time for that sort of shit while you're on holidays, babe. Yeah, cool, babe. It's ride, 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 ride. It's all about the ride. Yeah. There she is, guys. There's Victor Harbour. Look at that. Why have we got a crane head on the end of our pier for, babe? Oh, I don't know. Well, that down there, there's a resort or something down there, babe. Look. Right over oh, on the right. Is. Yeah. That's Granite Island ahead, isn't it? Uh, straight ahead over there where the crane is, yeah. We made it! Well, we're not quite there yet. <laughs> OK, guys, so we're in uh, Victor Harbour. Victor Harbour is located 83 kilometres south of Adelaide. It is a popular and attractive holiday destination on the Fluro Peninsula. It is an easy day trip from Adelaide, which was once the main port of the South Australian coast and the access point via a train to Goolwa for all goods travelling up and down the Murray River. Today the town is famous for its horse-drawn tram trip across the causeway to Granite Island where it is possible in the early evening to see the arrival of little penguins. We're over the back of it at the moment, the main street and everything. We're just mirandering around, aren't we, babe? Yep. Having a bit of a look-see. We've got a BWS next door now. Oh, that was never there. No, it was um, something Little else. Little legends. Yeah, or something. Or something. Celebrations. So, we're going to go straight into our motel, and then we'll take you guys out and about, won't we, babe? Yep. Right, Rusty's in here doing some washing. Let's go and see what he's doing. 
pot. Pot, babe. Pot. What's going on here? Pot. You got things under control? You're eight times Nick's, babe. I'm washing them for you. Oh, you're a good eh? man. I'm washing them for you. I'm washing them for you. I'm washing them for you. How did well, you know that word? Did you look, look at the tag? Look at the size of them. Did you look at the tag? They're fucking bloomers, look. You should not do that to women. Tassie's not that fucking no. boy. <laughs> look at that, but Tassie's here, boy. We should not be doing that. <laughs> Well, Rusty's duty's done and dusted for the day. Time to have a stubby and catch the beautiful sunset. Hello, gorgeous woman. How are you tonight? I'm well. With a backdrop like that, I oh, tell you. Marvelous. It's magnificent, isn't it, eh? What do you reckon, guys? We're coming out tonight. We're live. Well, not quite live. We're alive. <laughs> but <laughs> for how long? Who bloody knows? We're down on the beach at Port Victor. We thought we'd come out of the room tonight and do something different for you, didn't yes. we? Port Victor? No, we're not actually. We're That's at Victor the Harbour, the guys. We're at Victor room. Harbour. We're about to go skinny dipping out there, right out there. But look, have we not got a crazy sunset going down here? You know what old Rusty had to do to get her moving to come down here? Yeah, I had to bribe her with grog, as you. But we've pulled up at Victor Harbour today. We um, come down from Hondorf, the little German town. Very, very nice little town, wonderful. It was beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. We probably should have spent a little bit, bit more time there, shouldn't we? Well, yeah, we got in late. Well, did we get in late? We didn't get in late. The shop's shut. Got in early, but the shop's shut early. Yeah. But anyway, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do People come. People come. But. We come down to Victor Harbour, went up around the Fluro Peninsula, and I tell you how beautiful that was. It was a great ride, wasn't it? And if you've already checked our Facebook, you've probably seen us at uh, Normanville Beach. Wasn't it? Yeah, Normanville. G'day, how you going? Um, Normanville Beach, yeah. Very beautiful spot, wasn't it, eh? And then we cruised on to Victor Harbour, and now we're here for a couple of nights, and we're going to have a look around the place, but at the moment, it's all about the sunset. It's about romance. In that day, it's about romance, babe. Yep, see, I put romance my... in the bottle. I put. Oh, I was gonna say, I put my hair up and it's done it for you. Have you got your big girl panties on? Uh, Anyone that, anybody that didn't see the last video, I watched Kim's big boy pant, big boy panties for her. Big, didn't girl. big girl panties for her. Yes. <laughs> anyway, I'll leave you with the sunset. Okay, guys. <laughs> Look at that. Is that not magnificent? Look beautiful. I was never the one to write up a song for just anyone I, I was always the one to find myself lost in old conversations Oh, cause I've always been told that things will unfold if you keep on waiting But then you came along and proved me all wrong, I was so mistaken Cause you glue all the pieces back together Yeah, you